I wouldn't sign him, but it's okay because listen, if if that's what you do, they pay astronomical amount of money for 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 nothing. So if that's his talent, give it to him. That's the way I feel, you know. I mean I wouldn't but there's somebody out there that's got that kind of money. I, I don't, I don't, I'm not mad at him. I'm not. In fact, if he wanted a woman on the side, I, I could be number three wife, okay? That just kept the house together. Okay. I would. Right. I ain't gonna lie. All right. $350 million says a lot. A lot. $350 million says a lot. I mean, hey. I mean, to get people to, to, to be the third woman on the side that just cleans the house, I mean, this is, we're talking big money. There, there's no such thing as a cheap, cheap seat. Only this show is, is a cheap show, maybe. But, but cheap <laughs> seats, they, they, not if A-Rod gets that money. Not if A-Rod gets that money. I'll be looking at all the clips on the internet, catching all the sports center shows, and any kind of sports shows besides ours, of course. Yeah, besides ours. But we, we, we got some more people that, that responded to that, that, uh, that question about, uh, you know, would they pay A-Rod that money at? And we're going to go right to them because we, we got a lot to cover today because there's a lot of football we're talking about, basketball season's on the way. That's right, that's And we right. haven't even touched on hockey yet. Yeah, that's right. Drop so, the puck. He shoots, he scores. That's right. So here we go. How you doing? Fine. A-Rod is leaving. Are you sad that A-Rod is leaving the Yankees? Yes. Do you want them to try and get him back? Yes. Who is your favorite ball player on the Yankees? A-Rod. A-Rod? Okay, your brother's right here. Let me ask him. Would you pay the $350 million to have A-Rod come back to play for the Yankees? Yes. Why? Um, because he's a third baseman. He's the best player in the world. I'll definitely sign him. 300 and what? 50 million. Nah, it's too much, too much. Too much for the best player on the planet? Nah, he's not the best player because he, was, um, he wasn't doing his job in the playoffs. That's too much money. Mm -hmm. Too much money. Would I sign him? Uh, yeah, he's that good. He's proven it every year. I mean, he might not be around in October when you when you need him, but I mean, he gets you there all year long. I think the other guys need to carry their own weight too. He's carried a weight a long time, you know. All right. Inside information. I heard from a friend of mine. He's going to the Mets. <laughs> oh, you. Oh, we got a car hold on that one. Who will be the Celtics? Uh, every a very close source I know that is related to him. Says he's going to the Mets. Just want to let you know. <laughs> All right. He's, he's asking too much. I, I think that's um, he's really outrageous. Um, the amount of money that most baseball players are receiving. You know, I, I believe that personally, and I think that um, you know, the amount of money is, is, is outrageous. It doesn't make sense. You know, it's not worth it at all. It's not worth it. And, and, and eventually, people become discouraged watching. You know. They just they they they're basically for the money more for the sports I believe so. Absolutely. I mean he's you know the best there is you know and uh, if the money's available why not? No, because he's never been on a winning team and he's kind of greedy. How, what twenty eight million is not enough? Thirty million is not enough? Would I sign him? No. Oh uh, no, nah, I won't do it. He's worth it, but that's a lot of money and. If you got the Yankees got it, then do it. But his uh, agent Scott Boris is very pushy shovey, so <laughs> with the Yankees new sons, you never know. But I'll do it though. Three hundred fifty million. What are you a, a horror movie or something? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, the way that money is scaring people, it scares them into talking. Uh, yeah, the ki the ki the cute thing was the kids. You know, the kids the kids say that he's worth the money, and you know, it's not coming out of their pocket. You know, it's. It's like, uh, Daddy, buy me this toy, buy me this toy. You know, I can't buy it to you this week. 
Oh, come on, Daddy. Come on, Daddy. I mean, you know. Is that what Hank and Hal are doing now? Well, Daddy ain't got the purse strings uh, anymore. He passed over the purse strings to them. Yeah, but and, the kids are not buying. These, th those kids are not buying it, you know. Th that's the thing. George's kids are not going to buy it. And, and the Yankees said they would not negotiate with A-Rod. And I, I think... Well, that's the stance that they took now publicly. But then again, this is business. You got to look on the business side. Hey, he's the best player on the planet, and he's worth that money. Ever since free agency has came about, the price of free agency has gone up every year. The owners make the most of the money because they own the building. Right after the ball player is gone, that's it. The owners will still be making money 20 years after the ball player is gone. Yeah, well, you know, I mean, that's, that's a lot of money. That is, that's too much money as far as I'm concerned. I mean, you know, I, they, they as well hunger. I mean, gas is about to go up to about $4 a gallon. You know, this is, I mean, this is not, no. It, to me, uh, I don't care who it is. You know, it's not worth it. I mean. It, it's worth it. It's worth it. Come on now. No, it's the not. price, the market is driving this place up. It's it's a ball player's market now. The uh, the uh, end, uh, the Major it's League Baseball. It's a ball player's market. Well, I mean, they're they, making the they money now. Give, money, give them the money. No, I'm giving not, them the money. I'm money. giving them the money. 350 Yes, I'm going to give There's them $350. There's no such thing as a cheap seat. Anyway, <laughs> we, got, we got more questions that, that we're going to ask out here. And, and the next one should be a doozy. So uh, we'll be back right after this. How many games will the Patriots win this season? I think they're going to win all of them because of the way they look this year. Nine. Nine. Um, yeah, <laughs> optimistic. <laughs> well, um, 13. Oh, they going to lose some? Yeah, of course. I guess they're going to play against some hard teams. They're going, of course, they're going to lose some. They're going to lose like two or three. The Patriots? Yeah. 14. Uh, I think they go undefeated, actually. Are they going to win 15, 16? Are they going to go undefeated? I don't know, but I tell you who I really like. You know that guy? Well, I don't know his name. But he caught that thing. He said, wait a minute, he, t he caught it, and then he drug his feet. It was so acrobatic. It was so, it was so, I don't know his name. Which game you know, was you watching? I was watching about two weeks ago. I was in North Carolina, and it's a brother. And they they ruled the game. Remember, he caught the thing, and he was if, and then he drug his foot right to the line, but he didn't touch the line. It's okay, so they gave it to him. All right, so you like the athleticism of those athletes when they get like that? Oh, listen, when they beautiful, they beautiful, whatever. Okay. All right. You're beautiful, you're beautiful. 